Good morning. Welcome to the Praying Mom with PT, a prayer session designed specifically to pray for your children. The Bible says in the book of Mark chapter 10 verse 16, the Bible says, And he took children in his arms, placed his hands on them, and blessed them. Come on, this morning you want to lift up your voice into God this morning and begin to say, God, I thank you for a beautiful day. My children are in your arms, oh God. I ask that you rain your blessings upon my seed this morning. In the name of Jesus, rain your blessings upon my son, rain your blessings upon my daughter, rain your blessings upon my grandchildren this morning. In the name of Jesus, Father, I bless you. I give you praise and glory. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen and amen. We have been praying using the letters A to Z. It's episode three and it's at the end of episode three. This morning, we are going to continue with the letter Y. And I've said Y, yielding to God's will. This morning, you're going to pray. You're going to lift up your voice and you're going to declare that your children will yield to the will of God concerning their destiny, concerning their lives in the name of Jesus. Why yielding to God's will in the name of Jesus? Bible says in the book of Jeremiah, chapter 29 verse 11 it says for i know the plans i have to you declares the lord plans to prosper you and not to harm you plans to give you hope and a future come on pray with me this morning that the plans of god the plan of god to prosper your children the plan of god not to harm them the plan of god to give them hope and to give them a future let them yield to the will of god concerning them in the name of Jesus in every area of their lives let them yield to the will of God in the name of Jesus in their relationships in their choosing choosing their life partners we declare that they will yield to the will of God in the name of Jesus we declare in their career in their jobs they will yield to the will of God in the name of Jesus why yielding to God's will masekerebo shikaliande Jehovah, I come before you this morning as a praying mom and I pray that every decision my daughter makes, every decision my son makes, every decision my grandchildren makes, let them make them in accordance to your will. Direct their ways, direct their path. In the name of Jesus, Masatilari Basutoriande, First Thessalonians, Chapter 4, verse 3. Bible says it is God's will that you should be sanctified. Come on, pray that my son, my daughter will be sanctified in the name of Jesus, in accordance to the will of God. In the name of Jesus, he says I should avoid sexual immorality. Come on, declare this word into the lives of your children. It is the will of God for them to avoid sexual immorality. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray for my son. I pray for my daughter, I pray for my grandchildren that they will avoid sexual immorality. In the name of Jesus, let the will of God be done in the lives of my children. In the name of Jesus, let them yield to your will. In the name of Jesus, Matthew chapter 6 verse 10. Bible says your kingdom come your will be done on earth as it is in heaven come on declare that the will of God will be done in the lives of your children anything that they do on earth let the will of God be established in their lives, let the will of God be established in their academics, let the will of God be established in their businesses let the will of God be established in their friendships, their relationships in the name of Jesus as it is established in heaven in the name of Jesus, the will of God is divine acceleration. The will of God is divine elevation. Therefore, this morning, as a praying mom, I declare divine elevation into the life of my son. I push you forward, son. I push you forward, daughter, in the realm of the spirit and in the physical. I declare divine elevation. I declare divine favor. In the name of Jesus, I sent you forth to have dominion. Even as God has said you should have dominion, it is his will. Therefore, dominate. Anywhere you find yourself, in in the name of Jesus, you will rule. You had a head and not a tail. In the name of Jesus, the will of God is growth. Therefore, I come against stagnation in the life of my son, in the life of my daughter, and I declare growth. In the name of Jesus, growth in their academics, growth in their businesses, growth in their career. Let them experience growth. Everything that they do, let them experience growth, growth spiritually. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. 
Soriande, Ratsataba Zutariande. It is the will of God for my son, my daughter to be fruitful. I declare fruitfulness. Everything they lay their hands upon, let it prosper. In the name of Jesus, I declare fruitfulness. Fruitfulness in marriage, fruitfulness in career, fruitfulness in business, fruitfulness in their academics, in their jobs. I declare fruitfulness. They will yield to the will of God concerning them. In the name of Jesus, pray with me this morning. Pray, Mom. Rekebo Sotoriande. Man sotorable. Zed. Zed is for Zion. The children of the uh, children are children of Zion. Come on, you want to declare this morning in accordance to the word of God in Obadiah chapter 1, verse 17. Bible says, But on Mount Zion will be deliverance. It will be holy. And Jacob will possess his inheritance. Come on, declare this word into the lives of your son this morning, into the life of your daughter this morning, into the lives of your grandchildren this morning. In the name of Jesus, deliverance comes into your household this morning. Deliverance comes into the lives of your daughter this morning. Deliverance comes into the life of your son this morning. Come and pray with me. Pray him on. In the name of Jesus, my son, my daughter will be delivered from anything that has tied them down. Any long issue terminated in their lives today. In the name of Jesus, as a result of deliverance. In the name of Jesus, they will be delivered from sickness. They will be delivered from poverty. In the name of Jesus, delivered from lack. In the name of Jesus, my son is delivered from failure. In the name of Jesus, my daughter is delivered from failure. In the name of Jesus, they are moving forward. In the name of Jesus, Psalm 102, verse 13. Bible says you will arise and have compassion on Zion for it is time to show favor to her. The appointed time has come. Come and pray with me this morning. Pray him on. It is time. The appointed time to favor your son has come. Yes, it's the set time. The set time has come. Favor will speak on behalf of your son. Favor will speak on behalf of your daughter. It is the time to favor them. In the name of Jesus, the Lord will have compassion. The Lord will have mercy on upon my son, upon my grandchildren. I cry as a praying mom this morning. Your mercy, oh God. Let your mercy prevail over judgment in the life of my son. In the name of Jesus, let your mercy prevail over judgment in the life of my daughter. In the name of Jesus, for it is time to favor them. In the name of Jesus, favor in their academics, favor in their jobs, favor in their relationships, favor in their career. It is time to favor my son. The set time has come. I receive on their behalf this morning as a praying mom. Come and pray with me this morning. Psalm 102 verse 13. Bible says you you will arise and have compassion on Zion. Come on, declare that word. Key into that word. In the name of Jesus, mercy, mercy arise on behalf of my children. Mercy arise on behalf of my children. In the name of Jesus. Zechariah chapter 2 verse 10. Bible says sing and Rejoice, O daughter of Zion, for behold, I come and I will dwell in your midst, declares the Lord. Pray with me this morning. God will dwell in your tabernacle. God will dwell in the lives of your children. God will dwell in your home in the name of Jesus. There will be songs of praise in your home, songs of praise in the lives of your children. Your their lips will be full of praise in the name of Jesus. Shout of joy in my house. In the name of Jesus, Masekere was Shikariande, Ratete Masotoriande. Man, the boss so terrible. John chapter 12, verse 15. Bible says, Fear not, daughter of Zion. Behold, your king is coming, seated on a donkey's cart. Come on, declare the word of God concerning your children. They are daughters of Zion. Declare that fear has no place in their lives. In the name of Jesus, fear is being replaced with faith. In the life of my daughter, fear is being replaced with faith. In the life of my son, fear is being replaced with faith. In the lives of my grandchildren. In the name of Jesus. Mashaki Kaliande. For God has not given them the spirit of fear, but that of love, power, 
on a sound mind. I declare a sound mind concerning my children. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus mighty name we prayed. Amen and amen and amen and amen. Hallelujah. God has put it in my mouth today to pray for as many women that are expect, expecting many, many women that are pregnant. I declare the strength of God concerning you in the name of Jesus. God that has started a good work in you. We complete it in the name of Jesus. I pray that God will uphold you in the name of Jesus. You will deliver like the Hebrew women in the name of Jesus. Strength come to you today in the name of Jesus. An unusual strength come to you today in the name of Jesus. Every evil report, I stand with you and I cancel by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, I declare testimonies concerning you, concerning your household in the name of Jesus. Father, we give you praise. We exalt you. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen and amen. This broadcast is brought to you from International Prayer and Liberation Ministry, High Palm. For liberation prayers, deliverance prayers, prophetic declarations, join us daily for our midnight prayers with Apostle Victor at 11.45 p.m. UK time. For more prayers for your children like this, subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on our YouTube channel, High Palm Ministry. I would love to hear from you. Please send your testimonies, your prayer requests to dpmom at iprayerandliberation.site. If you do not receive this audio directly from me, and you would love to, we have a WhatsApp group for the Pray Mom with PT. Please email me to get the invite link to this group. The email again is dpmom at iprayerandliberation.site. If this audio has been a blessing to you, please share with someone. God bless you and bye for now.